Hi, welcome to this tutorial. We are going graphical. I mean, all this time we've been in the terminal, we've installed lots of stuff, we've followed the installation guide, and we're all the way down here and we boot it back up. And then they say there is also a post installation. Go check out the general recommendations. And in phase two, we made, for instance, uh, a user. We um, made sure they had had privilege escalation, so you can do pseudo stuff. We did also some changes in Pacman and the Pacman.conf, and um, now we're really eager to get graphical. So you go to the graphical user interface, and then you start reading. So we have this link here, but what we really need is Xorg. It's a public open source implementation of Xwindow system. So if we click here. And then you start reading and I say, okay, installation can be done with X server package. What's inside X server package? This is, these are the elements or the information about X server. Uh, additionally, you can also have X org apps. So all these elements will be installed as well. And there's also an X org group is also available, etc. And then you'll be seeking to install a window manager and desktop environment. So that's the next block. That's what I'm talking about here with these uh, nice colors. So let's uh, install everything and see if we can get um, this Xorg to work. So we are logged in as Eric, so a normal user. So I need to sudo pacman minus s xorg server is the one I want, xorg apps is the one I want, and xorg x in it, and also why not the terminal. So all these elements will be installed. Um, here's a choice that I have to take. There are two providers available for libgl, repository extra, there is this one, number one, and there is number two. If you don't know what to do, always take the default. In my case, I never bought an NVIDIA driver or uh, hardware, so yes, it's definitely going to be number one. And then a lot of information, you try to read it, you remember some of the info, and then I say, okay, yes, install me everything. It's a good time not to look away from your screen, but to start reading all these names like LM Sensors is an interesting guide in there. Mesa is an right an important name. The Xorg server is installed. So at some point in time, you start recognizing these names. That's my point. So that's it. We have now Xorg available. And if you want to test it out, just uh, type clear, that's why everything is empty. If you want to try it out, you just say start X. And then you see already that indeed there is an X server installed. We have windows here, we can do things here. But if you just want to quit here, then the left upper um, tiling window manager probably is um, the one to type exit and then everything stops. So that's the difference between typing here exit and again here exit so it's this one that really exits xorg so there you go xorg is installed but of course we don't want to have this kind of windows we need something else